since they so aptly presented themselves and we could gun them down quite so quickly. Very kind of them. Go stand on that for a second. Previously, to great success, they just have one and everyone in a position where they can just move up in one large group. Oop, and there's some birds flying by. It is so much nicer if everyone can just come up in one large group because why should something once when you can shoot it 47 more times? Let's find out what's inside that hangar bay. Now, we do have a sector pod thing around, so I would like to be in a position where I spot it or I can shoot it. I've got a visual. There you are. I'm happy to see you pull back. So we'll double tap, thank you very much. Why aren't you a grumpy so and so? No, not him I would like. Pitch wine of that little journey bastard. Okay, right, let's go down the line starting with the guy least likely to hit, but who uh, oh, you don't have holo targeting. Casino does. Yeah, you just stay there and let me shoot you to pieces. Can you miss an enormous no, giant evil robot? Target. You explode really loudly, Overwatch. Yeah, pick that up for me. More explosions. Always fun to see. You get hit on that or not? No. Destroyed something in the back. Right, so we're counting 11. We've got three Mouton Elites, two Moutons and a Mouton Berserker. That makes six. Uh, and we just took out two more. That's eight. So we've got three left loitering around, though. One of them is definitely an Elder. So everyone is going to hold this position for a brief, a brief second. So anything about the cresting? Worked really well there. It's able to get everyone in position to lay down a lot of fire on that guy. Also, having a sniper this highly ranked with double tap, of course, is amazing. So, would you want to? I want to shoot you to shoot twice. I want to really shoot twice. He can't move and shoot twice, but he can shoot twice. The roof is still on fire. All right. This is where we might get a lot of goodies from bringing this thing down. Not so we need them too much. Anyway, we are going. That's the way over that door. Just double check there's no one in there. No, there isn't. The little drone bastard will turn up later. Yeah, 
audience room. I am happy to have everyone. Gently scuffling along. Let's rock! Yeah, that'll be the drone. What the right hell was that? I don't think we're in a situation where I need to go chase that down later. Quiet. Do you hear something? Yeah, that's an elder. Oh, that's the bridge. So I'll be coming in the side. Oh, okay. I vaguely recognise the layout now. Okay. Fair enough. So let's um be a little cautious. Have a look. See if we see. If we don't come back. There you are, my sniper. You can't overwatch anyway, so you might as well just come back. And we'll have everyone else. Potentially going to have someone to go and hunt down that guy. Last drone, but I don't want someone getting separate because we do know there is at least still three of them out there. You stay where you are. You like standing, don't you? Stay there. Android. Call out. Run and gun your way to there for me, please. Don't take shortcuts or half measures, do you, Android? It's just like, I need to go that way. So I'm going that way. Right. Because I need to go that way. Alright, fine. Go that way. I am going that way. up, hang back just about to there so you don't leave zero completely isolated. Well, Anderson's not doing too badly for his first time out. Now obviously there are going to be critters and others on the other side of the ship. I guess there is just that drone, which if I end up leaving it, I'll just end the recording and I'll catch up with it later when I find the guy. Drones aren't too much of a threat because the um, damage they can do is pretty piddling even when they're critical, so I could send a person going off by myself once I'm sure that it is the last one remaining. So two more kills and I'll go drone hunting. Trying to get a shot in the back while you're around there, though, Zero. Alright, so the main squad's over there. The rookie's out on his own, so try not to panic over there, lad. Alright. I want to remember the layout of these things. That's quite a deep pit. I don't think we're alone there. out here. And it's quite a pain in the ass to get over to it. So I need everyone going through that door in one smooth motion to get as much damage out and downrange as possible. It's gonna hurt your knees, don't it? You are wearing. You guys are wearing some really heavy armor. Almost wish I could kind of plot the movements and say go do. Cue a load up and do it so you have them all move at once. Rather than having to kazump and bang, kazump and bang, kazump and bang, kazump and bang, kazump and bang. Well, at least you're walking down the slope. Okay. Just the one overwatch from this one because they don't come through the door. I want to go into the door en masse. No, not you. You.
Okay. Who's on the other side of the door? Well, pretty sure it's a bad elder. You hear that? That's just the drone. Right, okay. I want to make sure I can get everyone in as far as I possibly can. Right, you spread and spray. Run and gun. To there. Time to kick this sucker off. So yeah, as thought. No shot, not what I wanted. Any useful shooting opportunities at the moment. Strike. It's inside me. Okay, Android. Where can you get to? You're flanked by him. I'm intending to kill the bastard. Stay there for just now. There's the asshole.
I don't have a grenade, I don't have a stun, I can't have a gun, I can't shoot anyone but you. So one of my guys is going to get absolutely cragged by a heavy shot at very close range. There is nothing I can do about it. I should have used a grenade from him. Uh, hunker down. Uh, reacting. Alright, doing that is a thing. That's a thing. Let's just check something first. You can't get down there. Alright. Please do. Subduing time. Good night. Hey, you hear anything? Alright. So the enemy is back over here. Where is Stax? Easy now, soldier. Pack up a few of his mental injuries by blowing magic gas at him. All objectives complete. Yep, it was a lemony surprise. Um, got a little bit flunky at the end because my positioning of Android wasn't good. A uh, bit of a position where I thought she would just be able to lean over that barrier and shoot down. Apparently not. Um, so line of fire issue there meant I took a lot more damage. That fine little bit. So my rookie did get injured for a couple of days. Casino has been promoted. Will to survive. Reduce all normal damage taken by two. Nice. Anderson got promoted. Follow targeting if you please. That you consider. This version no longer has to so you can fire and then move. Uh, I would like the holo targeting. Nice. Your men certainly seem to have a knack for capturing alien subjects alive. Mm. I only hope they realize how important their work is in relation to ours. Ethereal please captive pass on my gratitude important. to our forces. So. Let's head for the Situation Room and the Grey Market, because we've got a lot of stuff that we can, indeed, sell. Damaged power devices, alien surgery, damaged flight computer, damage those... Nope, don't need those. Flight computers we want to keep. Stasis tank we get rid of. And I'm pretty happy with everything else. Complete transaction. So the we large lump of cash for my uh, perusal. Things are heating up out there. We're tracking multiple unidentified targets. Mm, doesn't sound good, does it? Research. New research project. Interrogate the ethereal, if you please. Working in close media, I would be worried about it as well. What are we going to get for our trouble? Got four arms. Unfortunately, while you're powerful as you might be, we've got an awful lot more unpleasant things at our capability because we've got power generators. Just pouring more coal on until you keel over and suffer hideously. Ooh. Side testing. Yes, let's have a look at that. I want to see what the results of the side testing are. Will we close this episode? We may be onto something, Commander. Our latest candidate is different. We're picking up levels of psionic energy unlike any we've detected in the previous tests. Is that squads ready? There we go. What have we got? Ever since mankind first looked up at the stars, 
we have wondered what lies beyond. So very few have dared to look in the depths. The depths of the human mind hold more secrets than we can possibly imagine. How ironic that the means to defeat our enemy comes not through weapons or machines of war, but from the sea. And if we have succeeded, we will have gained a glimpse of what we are to become. We will have created something extraordinary. Hmm. Nice. Azuki Masubi. To have a look. Psy abilities. Confirm. Nice. Use aim, mobility, and doing five base damage. Nice. Welcome along as a support unit. And there's our sixth squad member. Nice. What sort of loadout can we give you? Yeah, Titan armor because someone got in. Have a plasma rifle, plasma pistol, and a scope to start with because I don't doubt you're going to be a pretty awful shot. Nice. Yeah, because you're wounded for a day. All right, all right. Nice. Psychic. Definitely. Alright, so if we go to the Psy Labs, we can add quite a few other of our soldiers as well. That's interesting. Lady Grey. Uh, Takeshi. And Rune. Spend 10 days in a vat being gently probed by the scientists. Apparently it takes two days. Alright, fair enough. Alright, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I've been the Marmoset. We've discovered psychic powers in one of our troopers. We're going to put them to good use by using them against the psychic powers of the enemy, which we've seen them use psychic powers several times previously. But now we've got our own psychic powers, we should be able to combat them. Please remember to like, subscribe, or send me some kind of message using your psychic powers. Bye for now.